hey y'all welcome back to another weekly vlog so i am doing some things today i'm running errands i'm out y'all can i mean obviously y'all see i'm outside but um i had to come out because i need to go to sephora and get one thing for a video so i gotta get back home i'm gonna film a couple of videos today try to get those done you can see my face is already done um and I'm not trying to be out too, too long because my makeup is already done. I don't want to start sweating. It's pretty, it's not that hot out here, but it's nice. The weather's nice. Um, got me some Starbucks. Y'all know I love me some Starbucks. Yeah, so what are y'all up to? What did y'all do over the week, over the weekend? Let me know down below in the comments. So anyway, I'm going to sit here and finish up my coffee. I'm gonna catch up on some of the comments that um, I didn't get a chance to catch up on in my last video. So I'm gonna sit here and do that as well. I like to come to Starbucks. Well, not, I mean, I rarely come to the one over here, but the one where closer to where I live, I usually like to go in there because like nobody's ever in there and um, just, you know, do some work, comments, you know, scroll, just, whenever i feel like i just want to be out of the house and just you know whatever but yeah i'm here at this one because there's a sephora literally like right down there so i'm gonna run in there and get what i need to get and yeah but first let me catch up on you guys' comments <laughs> excuse me y'all know what i want to do i want to i did like a hopefully this reel looks cute i was trying to get some footage when i was in um back there at starbucks starbucks is back there y'all can't see it but i was trying to get cute little footages you know little clips here and there to make a reel but what i was saying was i want to I want to do a shop with me on my channel and I might go ahead and do that today since I'm going to be in Sephora and I haven't done one of those in a long time so I might do that today. The thing is they always have music in these stores and it's always copyright but I don't always want to have music over my videos. You know like I want it to be where you guys are literally in the store y'all can hear me talking y'all can hear like a little bit of background instead of it instead of me taking the audio out of the clip and putting my own music i like videos like that where it's not always um where it's not always what are they talking about back there yeah. but yeah i like videos where it's not always music like our music i like it to be as natural as possible like where you guys are actually here with me in the store but um but yeah what's saying <laughs> what i was saying was i like um when I watch shop with me videos I like when they're in the store and they don't have to put their music on some people just take the monetization uh, monetization off of the video just so that way it won't get copyright but y'all know I'm trying to get my coin <laughs> so I don't know I don't know how that would work but that's just something that I put down on my what I want to film list I have a list of videos of what I want to do but anyway let me get to these comments girl I'm just talking I'm just talking well I mean one for clarification I had which I needed to hear was ask and we can tell them to and they cannot come in for our trucks <laughs> girl when I tried the oysters did y'all see that vlog <laughs> y'all are so freaking funny. I was surprised at how many of you guys were interested in seeing like how I create my thumbnails. Honestly, when I was doing that, when I was editing the vlog, I was thinking to myself, they ain't even gonna care. But surprisingly, y'all are like y'all were interested in that. And I was watching that over. <laughs> I was over at Shanine's um 
apartment, Shanine, too much mouth. You guys know that she just moved here to um, to Georgia. But I was over there. Well, when I got over there, she was like, my video was on her big screen. I was like, dang girl, I'm on the big screen. And it was my vlog. And I'm like, oh my God. Maybe I'm just the only one, but I don't like hearing myself talk when I'm listening to myself on somebody else's like TV or phone. I don't know. It's just so kind of cringy to me. <laughs> and I'm like, am I really that country? <laughs> But yes, um, she had me playing on her TV. I'm like, girl, turn me off, girl. <laughs> Sometimes they make these too sweet. If you hate sweet, like y'all know Starbucks is full of sugar. But it depends on what you get and how you get it. But if you want to try the white mocha, <sighs> they put how many pumps of white mocha in this stuff I think they say they put five four pumps of white mocha some people make it where it's more coffee taste like you can taste more of the coffee than you can the sweet sugary white mocha which is good and then there are other people that'll make it really 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 strong with the white mocha sometimes when I have like a really big sweet tooth I ask for extra white mocha but if you want to try the white mocha on ice, that's what I get about um, the one on ice. And you don't like for your drinks to be sweet, I would say put just two pumps of the white mocha and you'll be good to go. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. Okay. All right, y'all, so let's go run in Sephora real quick and get this one product, this one product. And then I need to check my PO box today too while I'm in this area. So I'm gonna do that. Uh, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. I have some boxes at home. I, sh I didn't even think about that. I have some boxes I need to ship out and I'll be shipping out boxes to you guys. So if y'all follow me on Instagram, um, sometimes I just be sliding your DMs, especially the ones that I know that I see constantly over and over and over again, whether that's in comments under my video, uh, my posts on Instagram or here on YouTube. Um, I just randomly reach out to you guys. Sometimes I go in the comments of some of the videos on my channel and I'll comment, I'll say, um, hey, what's your email address? Da, 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 da. And then I'll like delete the comments so that way, because I know a lot of people don't like for their, um, you know, their email and stuff like that to be out there. So that's how I reach out to some of you guys. I just go in the comments and ask, you know, what's your email address so I can reach out to you. I'll go ahead and delete the comment after you um, give me your email and all that. And then on Instagram, I'll just reach out, you know, obviously through DM. But yes, I have five boxes at home that I need to ship out. So I'm going to do that later on this week. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do that later this week. Anyway, girl, let's go to Sephora so we can um, get what we need to get. Oh, I have on this little long sleeve bodysuit. This, honestly, this is a Skims dupe. And I got this. How, why did I just say it like that? This is a Skims dupe. <laughs> But I got this from Nordstrom like three years ago and I'm obsessed with that. I should have got more colors, but this thing is so comfortable and stretchy and smooth and buttery. But I got this on with the um, the pants that I always wear because I love them so much. It's the, um, let me just stand up and show you guys. These jeans from Boohoo, but let's go to Sephora. So on my way to Sephora to get what I needed to get, I walked by Urban Outfitters and we got a couple of things. I think I'm gonna do it like in a little reel so if you guys watch my reels on Instagram, you will see it. But let's go to Sephora where we need to go because that's what I'm here for. <laughs> Girl, I'm over here trying to shop, but we need to do what we need to do and get home. All right, I'm back in the car. The lady in Sephora told me I couldn't pull out my camera. I know the Sephora's don't allow that. Some do, some don't, but um, I was able to get a few little clips 
for reels on Instagram, I saw Jackie's candles. Y'all, if y'all didn't know, Jackie's, um, her brand, Forever Mood, is now sold at Sephora in store and online. So this is my first time seeing it in store. So y'all know I had to get, um, I hope they are not waiting on this parking spot because I'm going to sit here for a minute. But, oh my gosh, I hope they're not waiting on me. <laughs> but I had to get a little shot of that. Um, and I saw some of the candles, like, they are selling out. Selling out. But I want to tell y'all about this. I got this huge bag from Sephora, even though I went in there for one thing. I ended up getting another thing. Y'all, okay, they left. I thought they were honking at me. I'm telling y'all, I told y'all about this in my last vlog. You know when you sit in the car, people be waiting. Like, they be waiting, and it is packed right now. Um... But yes, let me tell you about let me tell y'all about this. If you like to spend your points, your reward points at Sephora, and um, you want to get it on something that's actually worth it, they have these bags. It's you have to spend 500 points on it. But this bag right here, if you go in Sephora, if you shop in Sephora in store all the time, and you got some points racked up. I highly encourage you guys to get this right here it was 500 points but if you use this instead of using their bags every time you go in there to shop you'll get the lady told me now I wish she put something in here cuz dang it she told me if you do that you get what was it points you get free points I don't know how many points was it free points or you get 10% off Ah what was it i wish she put like a little thing in here like a little let me see y'all know my mind is not longer than a minute <laughs> i finally 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 smelled this i got so tired of seeing this all over the gram i finally smelled the ysl libre um perfume delicious delicious this was worth it and I got a smaller one. I didn't get the large one. So, totally worth it. I wanted to wait and actually smell it in person before I blind buy it online. So, and I'm going to have to stop doing that. But everything that I purchase online ended up smelling good. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I got this. This smells so good. And then I had to get something for a video and that's it. Oh, I got one more thing, y'all. I told myself I was not gonna go in Sephora and get anything else but that one um, thing that I needed for a video. But this Natasha Denona, I saw um, Oct Octavia B use this and she uses, her foundation shades are a little bit darker than mine and I did not know that this would actually show up on me until I started seeing her use it. And I'm like, wait a minute, she's a little bit darker than I am. So I'm pretty sure that's gonna show up on me and it looks beautiful on her it's the natasha denona contour sculpting powder in the shade deep what's going on oh oh for the first time ever i'm seeing that my camera is getting too hot that's like the first time that this has done it wow but anyway this is it right here and this is how she looks so it's the new shade that they have is the deep one i think it's new but yeah, anyway, let's get home. My camera is getting too hot. It's like my first time seeing that, but yeah, let's go.
These are the ones that I'm decluttering. I know it's a lot of foundations and I know some of you are going to be like, girl, why are you getting rid of these? But these I don't even touch, y'all. I don't even touch these foundations anymore and they're old. So I'm going to get rid of these. Fenty. This is my... Now, not to say that these are not good. These are some of my favorite foundations. It's just that they are old. I haven't touched them in a while and it's time for me to get rid of them. This is my favorite foundation from Fenty. I feel like I've gotten good use out of it and I haven't touched it as much because I've been using the, um, the Fenty Skin more. This is everything. Everything I'm getting rid of. Old foundations, foundations I don't touch anymore out of sight out of mind and then everything else in here this is just what I decided to keep so I feel good we're done with the foundations so today's Tuesday I didn't pick up the camera anymore yesterday because I wanted to film those videos that I needed to do when I got back home y'all I think I'm gonna wash my hair one more time one more time <laughs> and then we're gonna take the braids down cuz yeah <laughs> I keep going back and forth if I want to take the braids out but then I'm like I don't want to sit here forever taking these braids out so we're gonna wash it well I'm just gonna condition it co-wash it and um, I'm gonna do this one one last time for the week <laughs> and I think I'm gonna take them down over the weekend I think it all depends on how I feel it all depends on how I feel, but it's time for me to take them down, honestly and truly. I'm really hoping this brand will approve the video, well, one of the videos that I have going up this week, because I didn't pre-film enough for me to have a backup video. But yes, girl, we about to hop in the shower. I did a quick little 30-minute stretch slash workout this morning, so I'm going to hop in the shower wash this hair co-wash the hair because it needs it really bad and then I'm gonna edit those two videos that I did yesterday um, 
And yeah, oh, let me show you guys. We emptied the Youth to the People cleanser, finally. And I've started using, we'll start it back using, cause I wanna go ahead and empty this out to the Herbivore Pink Cloud Creamy, uh, Creamy Jelly Cleanser. So I don't have much left. So I'm really just trying to empty it out. I'm not the biggest fan of this. I don't like how it doesn't really suds up. I like my skin, uh, my cleansers to like foam up, get really sudsy, and this does not do that. But I don't want it to go to waste, so I'm just gonna go ahead and um, empty it out. And um, I do like that it is pretty gentle though. It's a nice gentle cleanser, very hydrating. My skin doesn't feel dry when I use this. So if you if you like a hydrating cleanser that doesn't really suds up, that feels really jelly and creamy on the face, I think you will really like this because it doesn't like it doesn't leave your skin feeling dry. Um, it's really creamy, so it doesn't it just doesn't foam up. I like my stuff to foam up, um, but I just wanted to show y'all my little empty, my little empty. We are. Making another pile of empties. I have a um, drugstore empties that I want to do because I have a good pile, a good bit of drugstore empties that I finished. But anyway, let me take these clothes off, get in the shower, condition my hair, like really condition it, co-wash it. And then what else are we going to do today? Mm, we're just going to edit today. We're going to edit and then we are going to uh, plan out other videos. I have a list of video ideas. One video idea that I have, I don't know if it's going to be any, I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. So I purchased a few um, lip products. I showed y'all. I did, I did, I did, I did. I showed y'all the lip products that I purchased from Target. It was like a whole bunch of Jason Wu um, lip products. I have like a gloss, a lip mask, just a whole bunch of random stuff. And I also showed um, you guys, if you follow me on Instagram, I need to hurry up and get in the shower. But um, if you follow me on Instagram, I showed y'all a lip kit that I purchased is from Wet n Wild and I got it from Target. So I haven't even used it. I haven't used any of the Jason Wu lip products yet. So I'm thinking, how would you guys feel if I did a video dedicated on just lip products that I wanna try out, like testing new lip products with you guys? I don't know, let me know if you guys would like that. Um, I think that'll be a really cool video to film, just me sitting there opening all the lip products, testing them out with you guys, um, swatching them. Cause I have a other, um, I have other lip products that I still haven't opened up. And I think that'll be a good video to do. And instead of just pushing it off to the side and waiting to do like testing new product videos and where I just feature like one or two of the lip products, I think it'll be best for me to feature all of the lip products in one video. And I love lip products. You guys love lip products. So um, I think that's what I wanna do. I think that's what I wanna do. I think that'll be a cool video to do. Testing a ton of lip products that I purchased. Let me know in the comments, let me know. But let me get in the shower, girl. Let me shower up and get my life, girl. So I'll be back.
Hey guys, so today is Wednesday. I have on the same outfit that I had on in um, my last vlog because I want to take pictures and I'm actually over here um, about to pick up Shanine so I can kind of show her around a little bit of the area and then um, try to get some of her, you know, get some pictures for her as well. So we're working today and also just, you know, going around and looking around so here she comes I will talk to you guys later the pictures first because in an hour my face is gonna be sweating off <laughs> Shanine hello too much mouth hello and we are headed out to snap a few photos uh -huh. and I guess show you around Jay's gonna show me around <laughs> show me what it's like out here what they have to offer yes so far all I've done is go to Publix uh, Walmart and that uh, First Amendment place in Target. Place the restaurant. Oh, yeah. See, we ain't gonna talk about that. Yeah. So. I mean, the food was okay. Yeah. I, did you Did you like the food for real? I did. To be honest. I did. Okay. <laughs> okay. Bye, y'all. Want indoor or outdoor seating? Huh? Want indoor or outdoor seating? You want indoor? Probably got AC. Yeah. Thank you. weekend today is Saturday I was gonna spend the day taking this hair down but I don't feel like it <laughs> I don't feel like it I don't feel like it I don't feel like it mm, but what I'm about to do is my nails because I broke one nail and this is what like these nails this glue I don't want to say the nails the glue this glue is called um, KDS glue and it actually came with the nails. The nails are from Etsy. The seller name is um, Kelly Nail by Kelly. I'll leave the seller down below in the description. But this is probably the strongest glue I've ever, ever, ever used. So, and these have lasted me almost two weeks, I want to say. How long did I have? When did I put these nails on? It's been about a week week and a half two weeks almost two weeks but they've lasted for a good minute time for me to take them off i'm gonna put these on right here from the brand the nailist and i'm gonna do this design today so that's what we're about to do but before i do that remember earlier this week i was telling y'all that i'm thinking about doing a um like a I don't know what I'm gonna call the video but I want to do like a testing new lip products with you guys since I purchased quite a few lip products and I don't want to try one out at a time in each like in every testing new makeup product video so I'm just gonna do it all in one video um, I did not know this somebody tagged me on summer Friday's page they tagged me in one of the comments under the picture y'all know my obsession with the summer fridays lip balm and i was saying in my video where i did like my top three in each 
top three products in every makeup category i was saying that i wish they would change the packaging of this like how the tube is like the top of it and they did i didn't know this so i went ahead and ordered um another one of these it's just you know the the top of it is going to be different it's the same product from what i read it's the same formula and everything they just changed the tip of it so it's easier to um easier to apply on the lips and they came out let me show y'all i got my phone right here they came out with there it is look at this they came out with another color and i put it in the cart so i'm gonna go ahead and place the order right now but let me show you if i can show yeah there it is see the let me make sure there's nothing on the screen that has my you know how sometimes sephora will have like your location or whatever but anyway this is the tube i'm excited yes 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 and that's a different color i'm excited and then the original one of course this one right here that's the original one but i am about to place the order right now and i'll probably feature it um, in that video where I'm testing out like different lip products not the original one because I mean this is pretty much like a clear but that rose color I want to see how it looks on the lips so I'm excited yes um yeah anyway let me do my nails because I want to get that done for today and I guess I'll show you I'll like prop you guys up right here since I'm right here and y'all can watch me do my nails i haven't done like a nail video or a nail i haven't featured my nails in a vlog in a good minute so y'all can see how i do my nails let me lower you guys down about right here until you y'all i have been obsessed with this camera obsessed with the camera since we're here let me put this on because my lips are dry I'm excited for the new one y'all i don't like that you have to squeeze it out like this i'd rather just put it on my lips like this even though you can do it like that but i'd rather have a different little tip so it'll be easier to apply on the lips but yeah this is one of my favorite lip balms ever and i'm glad that they changed the packaging of it but yes let's put these on i'm gonna do what you're not supposed to do which is just pop these off i just be doing things the wrong way but i feel like if you wear the nail well if i i don't want to speak for everyone but when i wear my nails for a long period of time it's easier to pop them off because it's like almost like this right here the thumbnail is lifting so easily and it doesn't hurt see it just popped off so my nails are so freaking strong i'm using this new stuff let me go grab it so i can show y'all what i'm doing this stuff right here from olive and june it's a nail strengthener this has my nails so freaking hard i can't even bend them so this is what i've been putting on my nails um and it has been everything all right let me just pop the rest of these off and then we will get to the new nails
I know I told y'all about these nails in my last vlog, but y'all, when I say these nails fit perfectly, it looks like they're real acrylic. Like there's no gaps on the side. These are perfect fitting nails. So y'all saw that I was um, filing them down some because I wanted them to be, what do you call this? Uh, stiletto. And I might file them down a little bit more, like a tiny bit more. And I'm also going to go ahead and coat them with um, a clear gel polish because I want them to be shiny. Even though the matte looks pretty good, but I'd rather my nails to be a little shiny. So this is one hand. I'm going to go ahead and finish up the other hand, but I just want to show y'all how these look so far. I don't know if I'm going to pick up the camera anymore this weekend because y'all know I don't be liking to do anything on the weekends. <laughs> just um relax and all of that but if i'm not i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here so thank you guys so much for hanging out with me this week let me know um what you guys had planned for the week what did you do over the weekend let's talk about it down below in the comments and if you're new this is what we do on sundays we hang out we chill it's very laid back and just chill so yeah and then on wednesday and fridays you guys will see my regular videos which are makeup tutorials reviews hauls just stuff like that more professional type videos um but anyway thank y'all for hanging out thank you so much and i will see you guys later on this week